What's up, guys? It's your boy D Smith. Man, real quick, I want to talk about Kwame Brown. Y'all better leave that nigga alone. He ain't doing no plan. He ain't doing no plan. There's two things I want to discuss real quick. One that he has been going so hard on the Breakfast Club and Charlemagne the God. Charlemagne the God sent a, a cease and desist letter saying stop talking shit about my old case. I settled that case and you can't be bringing that shit up so stop talking shit. That's how hard Carl may be going on the breakfast club. Right? And the second thing is now people are trying to call him a disgruntled black man for the simple fact that he just uh, bitching and complaining now when all in the smoke podcast, right? Well, I want the smoke podcast was, was talking shit about him, right? So he just came back even harder. So people are upset that he went from on YouTube, I'm not sure about Instagram. He went from 6,000 subs to 116,000 subs within a week. So people are saying he's clout chasing. No, he is not clout chasing. He is just defending himself, right? He's just standing up for himself and while he's doing it he is talking shit he gave Steven Jackson fake gangster and Matt Burns Becky with the good hair <laughs> what are the quotes from uh, Kwame Brown my mama's boy you can't be talking about my mama's boy What's another one? You about to get some of mama good cooking right here. You about to get mama good cooking. So man, yeah, y'all better leave Kwame Brown alone. He ain't doing no plan with y'all, man. He ain't doing no plan. So, and Stevie Nate Smith just said, fuck it. Stephen A. Smith just said, man, he can say whatever he want. I don't want no smoke. I'm going to leave that man alone. And Stephen A. has left that man alone. But I think Matt Burns and Stephen Jackson like, fuck it. And Kwame, he uploads something every day every day just speaking facts he's at these niggas head he's at these niggas head man i better leave that man alone this your boy d smith i'm out of here